<laughs> while you were saying your whole spiel, I got a text from somebody. I just want to read you what this says. This is a question for you. Okay. It says, who is your favorite person that's a friend from the show till this day in all caps? Darius. And did Darius text you that? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> but, the, but, the, but regardless, like I know because I know Darius texts in all caps. Um, <laughs> but also Darius, I mean, regardless if he texted that or not, Darius is my favorite person, not just from the show, but like from my childhood of all time. Like that is time. my guy. I from- love him too. I ain't going to lie. I mean, I didn't. I know I probably auditioned with him and was around him back in the day. We probably yeah. were put into the room as brothers or something. Um, but I'm just a fan of his spirit. Like, um, and so that's why I asked him to be on the podcast. I just love the guy and I barely know him. Definitely love everything he did about Tupac, everything around Tupac. He's just oh, like A1 incredible. in my book. Yeah. Um, so incredible. shout out to Darius Love forever. Yeah. And I actually got a text as well for oh, you okay. um okay. might as well i mean since you 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 pulled out yours from angelique she okay. says um i'm extremely proud of you of uh, and the woman you have become and still are becoming love you to infinity and beyond if you had one superpower to help humanity what would it be and why oh i fucking love her so much that almost just made me cry actually she loves you I'm, too much I'm, botox I, I don't know that i don't know if the tears will come out but gotta squeeze them out Ugh. i know both of both of those people are just so significant to me um if i had one superpower to help humanity i don't know like how you would fit i don't know how you would make this into a superpower but i think like the ability to um like see people's hearts so we could like eliminate judgment and we could eliminate hatred and we could eliminate like just fucked up shit to so like like if you have you know if if you're in a bad having a bad day or something and you're like you know rude to the fucking waiter that you like some flash would come over you to see like them at home with their five kids that they fucking hustle so hard for just shit like that you know what i mean i mean i think we're so lacking of that or when you drive by a homeless person and in people that want to be like oh that's so fucking gross or whatever instead you see like in like a blink of an eye the entire trajectory of like where they were before they were homeless and like what all of the the factors that got them to actually like being a person that's houseless like stuff like that i think would be i think i don't think we would live in the world that we live in today that's for sure. If we could like actually see into people's hearts and spirits and, and history. And empathize and empathize with them. Yeah. Right. And the yeah. histories that like people come from, you know, um, that, and like, obviously if I had like a billion dollars to like get everybody off the street, that would be great too. I would love that. Um, you know? Yeah. But yeah, there's my I mean, answer. Was that Angelique's question. That was Angelique's question. Yes. Dang, Angelique. You know, she always got to get deep. You know, I Angelique. love you, baby. <laughs> I love you. Yeah, that was a good she's one. A, 